On opening day on Friday, the ski area saw more than 1400 people hit the slopes. They say it's a busy weekend and they hope it's a sign of what's to come this season. Last year was a good year, a, a slow start, but a, a good end. It's been a great start for Cannon Mountain. For the first time on record, they opened top to bottom on opening weekend. We opened in 1938 and we have records back to then, but nothing that would indicate um, that we had a full top to bottom run. Thanks to a $5 million energy efficiency project, they were able to upgrade over 400 snow guns. We have a lot more snowmaking power and flexibility than we used to have. So when we get ideal temperatures, we, we, we can jump on it and make a whole lot more snow than we've ever been able to. Cold weather and some natural snow help to kick it all off. Skiers and snowboarders are excited another season has started. I work at a ski shop in Rhode Island, so I try to ski at least 35, 40 days a year. And a lot of my friends have been uh, asking to group up and they're like, hey, let's go all ride and sweet. I was pumped to come up and we just had this idea yesterday to just come up and ride. The regulars are always ready to ride, but it may be difficult for others to realize some mountains have snow when they don't see it at home. Oh, there's no snow. No snow at all. Nothing at all. Yeah, there's no snow in Chichester at all. And it's just, it's crazy coming up here and there's a lot more snow and I can actually have fun and snowboarding. It's a tough sell sometimes to convince people that it's actually winter up here when they have green grass in their yard. But um, as you can see, it, it is winter for sure. Five other ski areas are open for the season. We have a full list on our website, WMUR.com. Reporting in Franconia, Siobhan Lopez, WMUR News 9.